When I saw this cool animation, I thought, wish I could also do that. Well don't worry after watching this tutorial you can also do that. To make this we will use Canva and CapCut. Don't worry if you don't know how to use CapCut just follow what I did. Go to Elements tab on Canva and search for Bouncing Ball. You will get a list of options form here select this one. Then select this crop options. Crop this bottom part only. So that it looks like ball is bouncing and just hitting the floor. Nice. Moving on to part 2 of our animation. Writing text. Write the desired word. If you are using 2 or 3 text then make it separate. Now adjust the position of the text. Click on effects and select hollow effect. Then duplicate the page. Then on the first page choose neon effect. Then again duplicate the page. Click on hollow for the main text then click on neon for other text. Now do this for other text as well. Since I have already shown you how to do it I will speed this process. Now come part where we will download the file. Click on share then download and make sure you check download pages as separate files. Designing part is complete now we'll edit all this file in CapCut. Bring your all files in CapCut. CapCut is free so you can easily do what I have shown in this video. Don't worry if you not use CapCut before I will show you all the process and details. First click on one video to bring it in our timeline. If you remember I told you to download file as separate. And this is reason. Now input all the design one by one. Bring the ball animation as well. Now you simply need to bring the ball animation on top like this. Now click on video then you will get this option to overlay. Select blend mode. Now it is easily blend over the text video. From here it is going to be a little technical so make sure you are fully concentrated. We want our ball to bounce like this. So first I will zoom out so that I can see my timeline in details. First make sure when the ball bounces. I know many will make mistake here by doing it like this. Just dragging it like this. What you need to do is adjust the ball on top position. Then click on position keyframe. Then move few frame forward then wait for ball to hit the ground then click on another position keyframe. This time bring the ball towards the text. You will get this smooth animation. Now do the same for other letter as well. Move few frames then wait for it to hit the ground. Move the ball onto your next text. Make sure you position keyframe is ticked. Now again position it onto your last word. You guys can see the color is not changing. Well here is the hack to do it. You can see the keyframe in ball video. You simply need to come to each keyframe and split the letter video. And delete the back part. Now you can see our animation is shaping up. Do this same for other two letters as well. Come to keyframe then split. Then delete the back part. You may need to watch a couple of times. And we are almost done. Finally export the file. 